Hey, how is everybody? Lou from RV Habit. Uh, today's project is going to be something I did a year ago on this RV. I installed a video doorbell uh, and it's worked out great. I'll, I'll leave the link to the original video up here. Um, so well, in fact, that I wanted to buy one for my home on the front door. So while researching it, I found that uh, Ring makes a video doorbell, but you can also buy a solar charger for it which would require you to charge the batteries less often. Uh, it says in full sun it'll keep them charged, but in on and off sun you may have to charge the batteries periodically. But I thought that was great for the RV, so I took the one from the RV, I moved that to the house, and I'm going to install this ring on the RV. Now, right out of the box, this is a little bit more money than the original one I purchased, but you know, you can tell it's it's much better made. It's all metal. It's got screws in it compared to just plastic snap-on. So it's definitely better made. And this is an option. It doesn't come with the ring, but this is the solar charger. And it plugs right into the back of the ring. And this is what mounts to the RV. And these little solar panels should keep this thing charged if it's in full sun. So uh, we're going to install that on the RV. Let's take a look. So I'm going to mount the solar charger and doorbell right where I had the old one. And I'm just using just a little bit of VHB tape. That's what I held, held the old one on and I had no issues whatsoever. This stuff holds great. So I'll just peel this off. So I have the solar panel base mounted to the RV now and now it's just a matter of hooking up the ring doorbell and where you would ordinarily charge it there's a little wire in here I'm just gonna plug that in just like that and it just snaps on and it comes with two security screws. And when I say security screws, it's not Phillips. It's a uh, security star bit. They give you the driver for it. It really is just to keep honest people honest and nobody can walk up with a Phillips driver and just remove it. But we'll just put this in. So now this is mounted at four feet high, which is their recommendation to get the best angle up, down, and side to side. So I've had this for about a week and I've been playing with it and it really is fantastic. So you have the Ring app installed on your phone and you just open up the app and click on the, the camera. I only have one RV door, but if you had multiple cameras, you just click on the one you want and you'll come up to this screen that says tap to go live or it'll also let you go back and see what it took pictures of because uh, it will take a picture uh, i think you can set it to every hour or every 14 minutes so it will take a snapshot too but it'll just go live and what you're seeing there is the picture live and it really does get a wide angle uh, view and at night it's almost like you have spotlights on it's crystal clear I can't complain about the quality of the picture. It's fantastic. But just real quickly, if you go into settings, this thing has so many settings. You can turn on the ring alerts. You can record motion. You can have motion alerts. You have an event history. So here's today. Here's yesterday. Uh, if you go back, you can disarm it, arm it. You can uh, snooze it for a certain amount of time, up to four hours. So if you just want to... Just put it to sleep for a few hours while you're working outside or something. You can link an indoor chime to it. Smart Alerts is actually pretty cool. It will actually, you can set it to just uh, activate when it sees people. So if a deer or something crosses, it won't activate. Um, I think it's a great feature. Device health, it'll tell you the battery, your Wi-Fi signal strength. Um, more motion settings and, and I mean there's tons of them you can go to the motion zones and as you can see uh, this camera has has four you can turn off different zones if you have movement over in a corner all the time you want to shut that off uh, really just tons and tons and even more settings you have video settings snapshot capture which I just talked about it takes a, a, a picture of uh, what it sees every hour and it, re it records it um, 
super, super, super uh, feature rich. Uh, I like it so much, I think I'm going to get a few more. The solar charger has worked fantastic. It lost 2% in one week and the side of the RV with the solar charger is in shade all day long. It does not really get that much sun. Maybe for an hour it gets sun. So it works. Uh, the solar charger is working fantastic. Uh, I'll update you if uh, it dies and crashes in a month. But uh, right now it works flawlessly. Uh, I'll leave a link below to where I got that. This is the second generation ring. There's like three different models. This one is ring doorbell, second generation. Uh, I'll also do a blog article on my website with some information. But as always, I appreciate you watching. If you see me out there, stop by and say hello and I'll see you soon.